Okay, let's now look at 1.3. So it says, during 2016, a total of 110,000 South Africans in the age group 16 to 19 years donated blood. The, SA, the SANBS decided to appeal to eligible high school learners to donate blood. I'm sure you've had this as some of you at your school. They actually come to your school and they ask you to donate blood. Their target is to increase the number of donors in this age group by an annual growth rate of 9.6%, compounded over the next two years. Okay, so basically, this is a compound interest um, question, okay? And now you could be saying, Marks, what does that mean? Remember, there's two types of interest. There is simple interest and there is compound interest. Simple interest, you just earn interest on a certain amount, right? So if it's 100 rand and I say you get 5% interest, it means you get 5 rand every year. Whereas with compound interest, you get interest on interest, right? So if I give you 100 rand and I say, Okay, I'm going to give you 5% compound interest. The first year, you get 5% on 100, right, which gives you 105 rand at the end of the year. And then the second year, you're going to get 5% on 105, right? So you earn interest on interest. So let's now see what they're asking us. They say calculate, showing all calculations, the target number of blood donors in the age group for 2018. Okay, so let's write this down. So in 2016... Right, we had one one zero 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 zero. Okay, in twenty seventeen, we want that amount, right? But then we also want that amount, right? Times by seven or nine point six percent. Okay, you see that because they said the once the target has increased the number of donors in this age group by an annual growth rate of nine percent, nine point six percent compounded over the next two years. Okay, so. We're going to put there 110000. That's how much you want, plus this increase in that amount. Okay, so let's put that into our calculator. Plus, make sure you type it in correctly. Okay, and that gives us 120560. That is in 2017. But we don't just want it for 2017, they've asked us for 2018. So in 2018, we're going to do exactly the same thing, except our starting amount is the amount in 2017. And then we want to increase that amount by, again, 9.6%. Right? So let's put that into our calculator. 120560 times 9.6%. Okay. And we see, right, that we have 1%. Three two one three three point seven six, right? And we know that we can't have like 0.76 of a human, so we're just going to round this off. Okay, so that is our answer. So they asked us calculate showing all show, showing all calculations the target number of blood donors in the age group for 2018. So the target number is this one three two one three four. The important thing here is to realize that you have to use the previous year. So you use 2016 to get 2017. You use 2017 to get 2018. So you kind of have to work very methodically to get this answer. Okay, that is the end of that. Let's move on to 1.4.